Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 uh, Atom Shop video. In this video, we're going to take a look at the Atomic Shop as the date is Tuesday and we should have a reset. Uh, the date is 17th May 2022. So, we're going to take a look what we got at the Atomic Shop and I really hope that there's something new. And uh, afterwards, we're going to take a look at the weekly challenges and call it a day there. So, let's start wasting time and jump right into it. So as always I'm logging into my wife's account because that account don't own any items whatsoever so we can see all the items that got listed on the featured list. And today we've got... Ooh, what's this? S2 Camp Bundle. Oh, for season 2, the glass, bro! <laughs> oh no, that's the season 2 camp... Oh, so basically everything that was included in season two is that what it is ship and a bottle army foundation military I, I don't remember if I have this I know wait what the all right I'm on my wife's account I'm like what's going on you know what we're gonna recheck this on my main account as soon as I'm done but yeah, I remember a lot of people were asking about the uh, this specific uh, uh, the glass, the greenhouse, and there you go, whoo, coolio. So those who've missed season two and wanted this, now they have a chance to get it. All right, so it looks like man, you can rebuy all this stuff. <laughs> season two, oh damn! So even the outfits have returned, lol. <laughs> And then we got season two weapon bundle as well. So all the skin, bro. That, that's all right. So if you've missed it, you have the ability to kind of get it. That's interesting. By the way, why they do do the same thing for season one? Or was it something that I missed? I don't know. Season returns. What about if we go here? Maybe there is a season one. Oh, there you go, season one. <laughs> Wait, is it on featured list? No, it's not. Oh no, it's in the greatest hits season one bundle. All right, all right, all right, man. I just jump and start jumping from one thing to another. Okay, you know what? Let's just go like this, and then the this was last week. I already covered this greatest hits. There we go. We got the season one weapon bundle. So if you've missed any of these, you will you have the ability to get it. Uh, what about alphas, by the way? Vaulting, so there we go. We got vaulting. This is something that's leaving soon. Special, nothing special <laughs> apart from this orange uh, shag carpet. Fr it's free, so well, why not and get it? That's that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, okay. So, bundles new, new, new season one, but what. I don't remember. Was there in season one some camp items that should have been like cling sink and stuff like that? I wonder is that gonna uh, make a return? I mean, this is pretty pretty cool idea. Like you know, if you miss a season uh, because you've never been playing this game, right? Let's just say you just you know just joined and you're on season eight, and you're like, man, I can't get those things. I mean, it's good and bad. I would say it's actually more good than bad because uh, people who grinded it don't have to pay for it. Uh, so it's a good thing that actually at least somehow it made a return. And there's a whole bunch of other stuff that uh, I haven't seen on the Atomic Shop like the Elden, uh, Elder Battle Code uh, outfit which is one of my favorite. I have it on my PC but not on the Xbox. And it was uh, given to us when we bought a bundle, which was in regards to some sort of conference. I don't remember. So basically, you just bought some atoms and got the outfit like uh, for, for, uh, as a bonus, if I remember that. That's how it worked. It will be nice to see those items also make it to the atomic shop. Like anything th that is like something that you, I don't know, or put it as an event to make it more game time. Like personally myself, I'm not playing right now. Fallout 76. Uh, I'm planning to return within the next season uh, to grind it out. 
and uh, get back to Diablo. <laughs> I've been playing a lot of Diablo 2 lately. Alright, so this is cool. This is actually pretty cool. Alright, so let's get on to uh, my wife's account. Oh, wait, on my main account. <laughs> alright, so now my main account, I want to see what's up. Yeah, there you go. I got it all. Got it all. Got it all, man. I got all of this. And by the way, I made all the reviews for pretty much most of these things. So if you want to buy something specific, uh, you can and check it out before you buy. You can go ahead and uh, check out my playlist for the season items, limited items uh, playlist. I'll have it in, pinned in the end screens. Uh, okay, so that's cool. I mean, even though, even though, have in mind, if you're new, uh, this is time limited, right? So eventually, this thing is gonna get off the atomic shop, but at some point, it will make a return because. If a specific thing gets on the atomic shop, there is a chance for it to return at some point. So, if you want to stay updated with the uh, Atom Shop Tuesday videos, feel free to subscribe. <laughs> All right. So, what we got for the challenges? For the weekly challenges, we got build anything in a workshop or camp 15 times, collect uh, 1,500 caps, uh, complete daily operation five times, complete goal a star daily challenge so basically if you do your dailies today this will trigger automatically complete an event 10 times complete an event uh, radiational rumble the best event out there that gives you the most XP uh, deal a critic deal critical hit to an enemy so basically you use vats and you click on your uh, critical meter and initiate those criticals the best gun to do this would be a uh, shotgun uh, then kill 50 cultists and level up three times. So, yep, that's uh, pretty much it for this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody can see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So do have that in mind. And if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Once again, thanks all for watching this video. And I'll see you on the next video. And as always, there's still a war going on, so if you feel like making any small donations, I will have two links to two funds created by the NBU, which is the National Bank of Ukraine. One fund is for military uh, donations, the other fund is for humanitarian donations. So if you're open to help us out, feel free to use those links, and anything helps. Once again, myself and everybody is very thankful to the entire world for all the support that we get, so thank you. And uh, you all have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys lock it at. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye. From the ashes we rose.